Pre A1 Starters 3. Published by Cambridge University Press and Uckles, 2019. This recording is copyright. CD1. Test 1. Hello. This is the Cambridge Assessment English Starters Listening Test. Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Here's a picture of my friends, Grandma. It is a great picture. Where are they? At my friend Mark's house. Is that Mark in the boat? Yes. He loves his boat. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. 1. And there's Grace. Which girl is Grace? She is swimming. I can see her now. There's a duck next to her. Yes, that's funny. Two. Where's your friend, Nick? Nick's playing football. Oh, right. He's kicking the ball. Yes, that's him. Three. And there's Anna. Which girl is Anna? She's fishing. I can see her now. Does she catch a lot of fish? I don't know, but she enjoys it. Four. That boy is reading a book. That's my friend Dan. Does Dan enjoy reading? Yes, he does. It's his favorite hobby. Five. A woman is standing next to the table. Do you see her? Yes, I do. That's Sue. She's drinking some lemonade. Is Sue your friend's mom? Yes, she is. She's cool. It's a very nice photo. Now listen to part one again. One. And there's Grace. Which girl is Grace? She is swimming. I can see her now. There's a duck next to her. Yes, that's funny. Two. Where's your friend, Nick? Nick's playing football. Oh, right. He's kicking the ball. Yes, that's him. Three. And there's Anna. Which girl is Anna? She's fishing. I can see her now. Does she catch a lot of fish? I don't know, but she enjoys it. Four. That boy is reading a book. That's my friend Dan. Does Dan enjoy reading? Yes, he does.
It's his favorite hobby. Five. A woman is standing next to the table. Do you see her? Yes, I do. That's Sue. She's drinking some lemonade. Is Sue your friend's mom? Yes, she is. She's cool. It's a very nice photo. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. How is school this year, Jill? Great, Grandpa. I have a new teacher. Oh, really? Her name is Mrs. Long. Is that L O N G? Yes. Mrs. Long's very nice, and she has glasses like me. How many children are there in your class? There are eighteen of us. Eighteen! Wow. Are there girls and boys in your class? Yes, there are. I like that. Can you see the answers? Now you listen. And write a name or a number. One. What's the name of your school? It's New School. New School. Is that N E W? Yes, that's it. Our classroom is really fantastic. That's great. Which class is it? We're in room number thirteen. Oh, thirteen. Is it a big room? Yes, it is. Three. Our new teacher likes singing. She plays the piano too. Wow! What's her favorite song? She loves the song "Ask." Is that A S K? Yes, "Ask." It's a song about questions. Four. We've got some computers in our classroom. How many computers are there in your classroom? There are four. Four? Yes, we really like them. Five. We have a pet in our classroom, a frog. Really? What's its name? Its name is Jump. J U M P. Jump. That's a very good name for a frog. Now listen to part two again. One. What's the name of your school? It's New School. New School. Is that N E W? Yes, that's it. Two. Our classroom is really fantastic. That's great. Which class is it? We're in room number thirteen. Oh, thirteen. Is it a big room? Yes, it is. Three. Our new teacher likes singing. She plays the piano too. Wow. What's her favorite song? She loves the song "Ask." Is that A S K? Yes. Ask. It's a song about questions. Four. 
four. We've got some computers in our classroom. How many computers are there in your classroom? There are four. Four? Yes. We really like them. Five. We have a pet in our classroom. A frog. Really? What's its name? Its name is Jump. J U M P. Jump. That's a very good name for a frog. That is the end of part two. Part three. Look at the pictures. Now listen and look. There is one example. Which is Eva's brother? Eva, which boy is your brother? Is he the boy in the brown jacket? No, that's my cousin. Is that your brother in jeans? Yes, and he's wearing a hat. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. What does Alex want? Dad, do we have any fruit? Yes, we do, Alex. Would you like a pear? Or some grapes? No, thanks. Can I have an orange? Yes, we've got lots of those. Here you are. Two. Where is Ben's tablet? Oh no, I can't find my tablet. Your new tablet? Is it on your bed, Ben? No, and it's not on my desk. There it is. It's on that chair. Thanks, Mom. Three. What is Bill's favorite animal? Do you like hippos, Bill? They're okay. Oh, I don't like them. I like crocodiles. I don't. They're scary. Giraffes are my favorite. Four. What is Alice doing? What is Alice doing this morning? Is she playing tennis? Not today. So, is she playing hockey? No. She's playing baseball in the park today. Five. Which is Kim's cat? Oh, there's a beautiful black cat. Is it yours, Kim? No, it's not. My cat has a black body, but its feet are white. And is its tail white too? No, it's gray. Look, there's my cat. Now listen to part three again. One. What does Alex want? Dad, do we have any fruit? Yes, we do, Alex. Would you like a pear? Or some grapes? No, thanks. Can I have an orange? Yes, we've got lots of those. Here you are. Two. Where is Ben's tablet? Oh no, I can't find my tablet. Your new tablet? Is it on your bed, Ben? No, and it's not on my desk. There it is. It's on that chair. Thanks, Mom. Three. What is Bill's favorite animal? 
Do you like hippos, Bill? They're okay. Oh, I don't like them. I like crocodiles. I don't. They're scary. Giraffes are my favorite. Four. What is Alice doing? What is Alice doing this morning? Is she playing tennis? Not today. So, is she playing hockey? No, she's playing baseball in the park today. Five. Which is Kim's cat? Oh, there's a beautiful black cat. Is it yours, Kim? No. It's not. My cat has a black body, but its feet are white. And is its tail white too? No, it's gray. Look, there's my cat. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Here's a picture of a living room. There are a lot of apples in it. I know. There's an apple on the lamp. Can you see that one? On the lamp? Yes, I can see it. Can I colour that apple pink? Yes, that's good. Can you see the pink apple? This is an example. Now you listen and colour. One. There's an apple in the bookcase. Look. Yes, I can see it. Can you please colour the apple in the bookcase blue? OK. I like that colour. Great. And a small girl is playing in the living room. Yes, she's giving an apple to her toy horse. Would you like to colour that apple yellow? OK, I can do that. Three. Now find the apple on the table. It's between the pineapple and the banana. That's right. Can you colour it orange? I'm colouring it now. Four. Do you see the man? He's sitting on the sofa. Yes, he's eating an apple. It looks good. Well, let's colour that apple red. OK, I can do that. Five. There's an apple on the tree. Yes. Would you like to choose a colour for the apple on the tree? I would like to colour it purple. That's great. I really like this picture now. Me too. Thanks. Now listen to part four again. One. There's an apple in the bookcase. Look. Yes, 
I can see it. Can you please colour the apple in the bookcase blue? OK. I like that colour. Great. Two. And a small girl is playing in the living room. Yes. She's giving an apple to her toy horse. Would you like to colour that apple yellow? OK, I can do that. Three. Now find the apple on the table. It's between the pineapple and the banana. That's right. Can you colour it orange? I'm colouring it now. Four. Do you see the man? He's sitting on the sofa. Yes, he's eating an apple. It looks good. Well, let's colour that apple red. OK, I can do that. Five. There's an apple on the tree. Yes. Would you like to choose a colour for the apple on the tree? I would like to colour it purple. That's great. I really like this picture now. Me too. Thanks. That is the end of the Starters Listening Test. Test 2. Hello, this is the Cambridge Assessment English Starters Listening Test. Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Look, Grandma. This is a photo of my school. Who's that woman in the hat? That's Anna. She stops the cars for the children. Anna's really nice. That's good. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. Are you in this photo, Pat? Yes, Grandma. I'm running in the playground. Can you see me? Oh, yes. You're very good, Pat. Thanks. I love running. That girl is clapping her hands. The girl with long brown hair? Yes, that's right. What's her name? It's Grace. She's my friend. Grace, that's a nice name. Three. 
Three. And that boy's my friend too. His name's Dan. Which one? He's got a ball. Is Dan wearing glasses? Yes, he is. Four. Who's the girl next to the woman? Oh, that's May. What has May got in that box? It's a frog. Oh. Five. And is that your friend Sam? He's riding a bike. And wearing a baseball cap? Yes, that's Sam. Well, this is a great photo. Thanks, Grandma. Now listen to part one again. One. Are you in this photo, Pat? Yes, Grandma. I'm running in the playground. Can you see me? Oh yes. You're very good, Pat. Thanks. I love running. Two. That girl is clapping her hands. The girl with long brown hair. Yes, that's right. What's her name? It's Grace. She's my friend. Grace. That's a nice name. Three. And that boy's my friend too. His name's Dan. Which one? He's got a ball. Is Dan wearing glasses? Yes, he is. Four. Who's the girl next to the woman? Oh, that's May. What has May got in that box? It's a frog. Oh. Five. And is that your friend Sam? He's riding a bike, and wearing a baseball cap. Yes, that's Sam. Well, this is a great photo. Thanks, Grandma. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen, and write a name. Or a number. There are two examples. You've got a lot of pets, Kim. Yes, this is my dog. What's its name? Ben. B E N. That's right, Ben. How old is your dog? One year old. One? That's young. Yes, it is. Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or a number. One. Are those your chickens? They're my mom's. She gets eggs from them. How many chickens are there? Nineteen. Nineteen. That's a lot. I know. Two. Is that your mom's duck? No, that's my duck. Her name's Lucy. Lucy? Yes. You spell it L U C Y. Three. Can I see some goats in the garden? Yes, my dad likes goats. He's got five. Five. Yes, they eat a lot.
four. What pets has your brother got? He has a lizard. That's nice. Yes, its name is zebra. Zebra? Yes, Z E B R A. It's a cool name. Five. Is your brother's lizard old? Uh, yes. It's eleven. Eleven. Wow. It likes living in our house. Now listen to part two again. One. Are those your chickens? They're my mom's. She gets eggs from them. How many chickens are there? Nineteen. Nineteen. That's a lot. I know. Two. Is that your mom's duck? No, that's my duck. Her name's Lucy. Lucy. Yes, you spell it L U C Y. Three. Can I see some goats in the garden? Yes, my dad likes goats. He's got five. Five. Yes, they eat a lot. Four. What pets has your brother got? He has a lizard. That's nice. Yes, its name is Zebra. Zebra? Yes, Z E B R A. It's a cool name. Five. Is your brother's lizard old? Uh, yes. It's eleven. Eleven. Wow. It likes living in our house. That is the end of part two. Part three. Look at the pictures. Now listen and look. There is one example. What can the girl's brother do? My brother loves baseball. He's four years old. Can he throw? No, and he can't catch. But he can kick. But that's not good for baseball. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. What is the teacher giving to the children? Can we have the tablets today, Miss Gray? No. Let's draw pictures today. I've got some crayons for you. Here you are. Thanks. Alex has got some paper for you. Two. Which is Bill's grandma? Is that your grandma, Bill? I like her boots. Me too. And she's smiling. She's got a nice dress. Oh no, that's not her. My grandma's wearing trousers today. Three. What would Jill like for lunch? Can I have a burger and carrots for lunch, please? Yes, and peas. No thanks, but I'd like an apple. Okay. Four. 
Where is Nick's guitar? Mum, I can't find my guitar. Is it in the kitchen? Uh, no. Is it in your bedroom? I can't see it. Oh, Nick. Here it is, on the sofa in the living room. Five. What is Eva doing? What's that music? Is Eva watching TV? No, she's singing a song to her doll. That's nice. Yes, they play that song a lot on the radio. Now listen to part three again. One. What is the teacher giving to the children? Can we have the tablets today, Miss Gray? No, let's draw pictures today. I've got some crayons for you. Here you are. Thanks. Alex has got some paper for you. Two. Which is Bill's grandma? Is that your grandma, Bill? I like her boots. Me too. And she's smiling. She's got a nice dress. Oh no, that's not her. My grandma's wearing trousers today. Three. What would Jill like for lunch? Can I have a burger and carrots for lunch, please? Yes. And peas? No, thanks. But I'd like an apple. OK. Four. Where is Nick's guitar? Mum, I can't find my guitar. Is it in the kitchen? Uh, no. Is it in your bedroom? I can't see it. Oh, Nick. Here it is, on the sofa in the living room. Five. What is Eva doing? What's that music? Is Eva watching TV? No, she's singing a song to her doll. That's nice. Yes. They play that song a lot on the radio. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Look at this picture, Dad. This family like fish. Yes. Would you like to colour them? OK. Can you see the fish on the woman's T-shirt? Colour that fish red. I'm colouring the fish on the T-shirt now. Good. Can you see the red fish? This is an example. Now you listen and colour. One. What now? Look at the fish on the chair. OK. Colour that fish orange. Right. That's a good colour for the fish on the chair. The cat's got a toy fish in its mouth. Oh, yes. Can you colour that fish blue, please? Yes. Cats love fish. Yes, I know. Three. 
Look at that fish on the floor. It's very big. The fish on the floor? Yes, it is. What colour can I do that fish? Purple, please. OK. Four. Now can I colour something yellow? Yes. The girl's bag has got a fish on it. Can you colour that? The fish on the bag? Yes. I'm doing it now. That's very good. Five. And now the fish on the poster. The fish on the poster on the wall. Let's make it green. Great. I like that colour. Me too. Well done. This is a great picture now. Thanks. Now listen to part four again. One. What now? Look at the fish on the chair. OK. Colour that fish orange. Right. That's a good colour for the fish on the chair. The cat's got a toy fish in its mouth. Oh, yes. Can you colour that fish blue, please? Yes. Cats love fish. Yes, I know. Three. Look at that fish on the floor. It's very big. The fish on the floor? Yes, it is. What colour can I do that fish? Purple, please. OK. Four. Now can I colour something yellow? Yes. The girl's bag has got a fish on it. Can you colour that? The fish on the bag? Yes. I'm doing it now. That's very good. Five. And now the fish on the poster. The fish on the poster on the wall. Let's make it green. Great. I like that colour. Me too. Well done. This is a great picture now. Thanks. That is the end of the Starters Listening Test. Test 3. Hello, this is the Cambridge Assessment English Starters Listening Test.
Look at part one. Now look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. Look, this is a photo of my favourite toy shop. That's nice, Anna. Are you in the photo? Yes, I'm with my mum. Are you holding your mum's hand, Anna? That's right. Can you see the line? This is an example. Now you listen and draw lines. One. My friend Hugo is in this photo too. Where is he? He's sitting on the chair. Is Hugo wearing glasses? Yes. Two. Is your friend's mum in the toy shop too? Yes, her name's Jill. Is Jill wearing boots? Yes, and she's looking at a book about trees. Three. That woman has got a big smile. Yes, her name's Sue. Sue? Yes. She's looking at that toy mouse. It's funny. <laughs> yes, it is. Four. Do you know that boy on the floor? Yes, that's Ben. What is he playing with? It's a train. Ben loves them. Yes, I can see. Five. And that man is my friend's dad. His name's Mark. Is he looking at the doll's house? Yes, it's my friend's birthday. Mark wants the doll's house for her. It's very beautiful. Yes, I'd like to have one of those. Now listen to part one again. One. My friend Hugo is in this photo too. Where is he? He's sitting on the chair. Is Hugo wearing glasses? Yes. Two. Is your friend's mum in the toy shop too? Yes. Her name's Jill. Is Jill wearing boots? Yes. And she's looking at a book about trees. Three. That woman has got a big smile. Yes, her name's Sue. Sue? Yes, she's looking at that toy mouse. It's funny. <laughs> yes, it is. Four. Do you know that boy on the floor? Yes, that's Ben. What is he playing with? It's a train. Ben loves them. Yes, I can see. Five. And that man is my friend's dad. His name's Mark. Is he looking at the doll's house? Yes, it's my friend's birthday. Mark wants the doll's house for her. It's very beautiful. Yes, I'd like to have one of those. That is the end of part one. Part two. Look at the picture. Listen and write a name or a number. There are two examples. Hello. What's your name? My name's Sam. Sam? Yes. You spell it S A M. And how old are you? I'm seven. You're seven? Yes, that's right. 
Can you see the answers? Now you listen and write a name or a number. One. What are you doing, Sam? I'm drawing a picture of a zoo. I see. What's the name of the zoo? It's Pet Zoo. Do you spell that P E T? Yes, Pet. That's right. Two. What are your favorite animals? Monkeys. They're very silly. And how many are there in this zoo? Nineteen. Nineteen. Wow, that's a lot. I know. Three. And this is my favorite monkey. <laughs> He's really funny. Has he got a name? Yes, it's Baby. B A B Y. It's very small. Baby is a good name for it. Thanks. Four. This picture is for my teacher. Is your teacher Mrs. Truck? Yes. Do you spell truck? T R U C K. Yes. My classmates and I like drawing pictures for her. Five. Are there a lot of children in your class? No, there are twelve. Pardon? There are twelve. That's good. Yes, my class is great. Now listen to part two again. One. What are you doing, Sam? I'm drawing a picture of a zoo. I see. What's the name of the zoo? It's Pet Zoo. Do you spell that P E T? Yes, Pet. That's right. Two. What are your favorite animals? Monkeys. They're very silly. And how many are there in this zoo? Nineteen. Nineteen. Wow, that's a lot. I know. Three. And this is my favorite monkey. <laughs> He's really funny. Has he got a name? Yes, it's Baby. B A B Y. It's very small. Baby is a good name for it. Thanks. Four. This picture is for my teacher. Is your teacher Mrs. Truck? Yes. Do you spell truck? T R U C K. Yes, my classmates and I like drawing pictures for her. Five. Are there a lot of children in your class? No, there are twelve. Pardon? There are twelve. That's good. Yes. My class is great. That is the end of part two. Part three.
Look at the pictures. Now listen and look. There is one example. Who is in Kim's photo? Is this a photo of your family, Kim? Yes, that's my cousin. And is that your grandma and your father? That's right. My mother isn't in this photo. Can you see the tick? Now you listen and tick the box. One. What animal is Alex thinking about? Okay, let's play a game. What animal is this? It's got a long tail, and it isn't a snake. Can it swim? Yes, and it's scary. So it's not a horse. I know, Alex. It's a crocodile. Yes, that's right. Two. Which is Grace's monster picture? Which is your monster picture, Grace? My monster has got four eyes. Wow! Where are they in its arms? Yes, and its ears are in its legs. Three. Where are the tennis rackets? Children, let's go to the playground and play tennis. Where are the rackets? They're not in the classroom. No, they're in the sports hall. Go and get them, please. Okay, and we've got the balls. Four. What is new in Dan's bedroom? Do you like my bedroom? It's great. Is that a new desk, Dan? No, but look, I've got a new lamp. That's good. You can sit in that old armchair and read your story books. Five. What is in Grandpa's garden? What has Grandpa got in his garden? Let's look. Well, he hasn't got tomatoes. I don't like those, but he's got potatoes. Great. We can have them with some carrots for dinner. Now listen to part three again. One. What animal is Alex thinking about? Okay, let's play a game. What animal is this? It's got a long tail, and it isn't a snake. Can it swim? Yes, and it's scary. So it's not a horse. I know, Alex. It's a crocodile. Yes, that's right. Two. Which is Grace's monster picture? Which is your monster picture, Grace? My monster has got four eyes. Wow! Where are they in its arms? Yes. And its ears are in its legs. Three. Where are the tennis rackets? Children, let's go to the playground and play tennis. Where are the rackets? They're not in the classroom. No, they're in the sports hall. Go and get them, please. Okay, and we've got the balls. Four. What is new in Dan's bedroom? 
Do you like my bedroom? It's great. Is that a new desk, Dan? No, but look, I've got a new lamp. That's good. You can sit in that old armchair and read your story books. Five. What is in Grandpa's garden? What has Grandpa got in his garden? Let's look. Well, he hasn't got tomatoes. I don't like those, but he's got potatoes. Great. We can have them with some carrots for dinner. That is the end of part three. Part four. Look at the picture. Listen and look. There is one example. This is a nice kitchen. It's got a lot of cakes in it. Yes. Do you want to color them? Okay. Look at the cake on the table. The cake on the table? Yes. Color that cake purple, please. Can you see the purple cake? This is an example. Now you listen and color. One. What can I color now? There's a cake in the cupboard. Oh yes. Color that cake yellow. Okay, I'm coloring the cake in the cupboard now. Two. What color now? Brown is a good color for a cake. Right. Which cake is that color? The one next to the flowers in the window. Yes, the one next to the flowers. That's good. Three. The girl has a picture of a cake on her T-shirt. There's a cake on the girl's T-shirt. Yes. Look, I can color that cake green. Okay. Four. And there's a poster on the wall with a cake on it. Oh yes, I like the cake on the poster. It's a birthday cake. What color would you like to do that cake? Ah,、uh, red. That's my favorite color. Great. Color that cake now, please. Five. Can you see? The cat is sleeping on a rug with a picture of a cake. You can color that cake blue. Okay. I'd like a rug with a cake on it for my bedroom. Yes, me too. Now listen to part four again. One. What can I color now? There's a cake in the cupboard. Oh yes. Color that cake 
yellow. Okay. I'm coloring the cake in the cupboard now. Two. What color now? Brown is a good color for a cake. Right. Which cake is that color? The one next to the flowers in the window. Yes, the one next to the flowers. That's good. Three. The girl has a picture of a cake on her t shirt. There's a cake on the girl's t shirt? Yes, look. I can color that cake. Green. Okay. Four. And there's a poster on the wall with a cake on it. Oh, yes. I like the cake on the poster. It's a birthday cake. What color? Would you like to do that cake? Uh, red. That's my favorite color. Great. Color that cake now, please. Five. Can you see? The cat is sleeping on a rug with a picture of a cake. You can color that cake blue. Okay. I'd like a rug with a cake on it for my bedroom. Yes, me too. That is the end of the starters listening test.